All right, everybody, here we go again. Let's go Mets is the rallying cry. A little bit different lineup here in the first game of this doubleheader. The second game will probably have something similar. Um, Lenny Dykstra is tired. He will sit today. Carter will play first base because uh, Keith Hernandez is tired, and um, we don't have a real first baseman, which is the same problem the Mets have had in real life. It means Ed Hearn is uh, behind the plate. Uh, so it's kind of a different look here. Um, of course, uh, Wilson will go to center. Danny Heap in left, and uh, that tells you how much I think of George Foster. We're against uh, Juan Marcel here today, and it's going to be Dwight Gooden on the mound for us. So it's another one of those uh, dream matchups, and uh, let's see what we can do. Here comes the first pitch to Wilson, and it is a strike. 0-1, oh fastball at 90. Next pitch is fouled away. It's 0-2, oh just like that. Uh, Wilson hitting 333. And takes the ball inside, one and two. That's low and away. Mookie able to hold back, two and two to count. Hit over to center, deep, but playable. Willie's got it, one away. I'm sorry, that's a Felipe Alou in center. So the uh, Giants, I didn't even look at them, uh, also have a different uh, type of lineup here today. Here's Danny Heap. He hits a ground ball over the short. It's uh, going to be uh, thrown to first by Pagan, and there's two away. Here comes Daryl Strawberry. The strawberry back in there after taking the day off yesterday takes a strike. Swing and a miss, 0-2. Oh, Looked pretty bad on that one. Strike three. Swing and a miss on that. Where was that pitch, Daryl? Go to the bottom of the first. Here's Felipe Alou. Takes a strike from good, 0-1. Oh, There's a changeup for a ball, 1-1. One and one. Swing and a miss, 1-2. and two. Dwight struck out only 52 so far this season. Just fell away. Still one and two. Curveball just away. Just misses. Two and two the count. Ball three low. That fastball, but not the good one. Full count. Swing and a miss. Down he goes. One away. Here comes Jim Davenport now hitting second. He hit uh, eighth, seventh yesterday. And there's a strike inside. Way low and inside. That's a good and strike. And there's a ball. One and one. That's a ball low, two and one. He's been low a lot here so far. Foul to the right side, two and two. Just misses, full count. Fouled away again, full count remains. That's hit over to center. That's going to be in front of Wilson uh, for a base hit. So uh, that brings up Willie McCovey. McCovey did not start in the game before this. Uh, left fielder who has nine home runs. Lots of power here in the Giants lineup. There's a strike in the outside corner, 0-1. Fouled away, it's 0-2. That's inside for a ball. Not sure how much that missed by. And there's a ball outside, 2-2. Two two. Can't get him to chase. That's a big curveball, and that uh, caused him to pop it up. It'll be a Backman grabbing that for the out two away. Here comes Tom Haller, the catcher. I'll take a strike, 0-1. Oh That's low, 1-1. One one. There's a strike right down the middle, 1-2. And, two. and uh, that one got away from him. He hit Holler with it. It was a curve that uh, broke a little bit too soon. That'll bring up Cepeda. Suppose a good and curve doesn't hurt as much as a good and fastball would. 0-2 oh quickly in Orlando. Swing and a miss, down he goes. So good and strikes out two, and we go to the top of the second. Here comes Gary Carter. Takes a strike at the knees from uh, Marcel, 0-1. Oh Swing and a miss, it's 0-2. Oh Fly ball center field, and uh, it's going to be uh, caught there by Alou, one away. Tell you, Marcel's uh, famous high leg kick is not really recreated all that well here. <laughs> this is a strike in the outside corner and a little high to Ray Knight, but in the zone, 0-1. Oh and, and there's a slider low, 1-1 one one to count. That's inside, two and one. There's a strike, two and two. Round ball over to short, should be easy, and it is for Pagan. Two away, here comes Wally Backman. Had a home run uh, in yesterday's game. Hit deep to right, but that's curving foul, I think. Yes, foul, 0 oh and one. That's a ball, one and one. Foul the way, it's one and two. Couldn't time that uh, curveball quite right. One and two remains. That's hit the other way. One and two. So we've gone right, left, right, left with these fouls. That's low. Two and two. 
That's high, so it's a full count. Boy, good eye. And that's ball four. And so uh, Backman works the walk two away, and here comes Santana. He's a throw to first, thinking the same thing I am, which is with Santana up there, might as well try to steal. Santana, first pitch swing, hits that deep to left, but not deep enough. Uh, Willie McCovey's there for the catch. We go to the bottom of the second inning, still no score. Here's Matty Alou. Said Felipe Alou, didn't I? This is Matty Alou. One and one the count. He's the one who's in the center. Felipe's still on right. I'm going to get confused here. Two and one now the count. And it's lined through the hole on the right side for a base hit. So uh, Matty Alou gets a hit off of good, and that'll bring up Jose Pagan. And we go back to double play depth again. Fouled away. Pagan was trying to bunt. 0-1. Uh, oh and, and he does bunt this time. Only play is at first base for Carter. He turns around and flips to the backman. So there's one away. Alou on at second. Here comes Chuck Hiller. It's a ball low. 1-0 and oh to Hiller. It's hit over to left. That'll be playable. Uh, it's uh, Heap uh, grabbing that for the out. Two away. And uh, here comes Juan Marichel. He'll take a curve high. 1-0. and oh. There's a ball low. 2-0 oh the count. And it's low again, 3-0. and oh. And there's ball four. I tell you, Gooden has his habit of walking pitchers. We've seen that a lot. And here comes Alou. Swings and misses. And then fouls one away. It's 0-2. That's high. 1-2 and two the count. I should say Felipe Alou. Ground ball over to Santana. Throws the first. And uh, we go to the top of the third inning. No score. Ed Hearn comes up to bat. There's a ball outside. By the way, I think it counts as an off day for Carter if he doesn't catch. It's a strike on the outside corner. That was, um, according to the diagram, over the play. One and one. This is fouled away now. It's one and two. Inside. Two and two. And that changeup is low, so it's a full count now on him. Fouled away. That'll go out of play. So, uh... Tell you, uh, Ed is doing a good job making Juan Marichal work. Swing and miss, and down he goes. Second strikeout for Marichal. That was 90 miles an hour. Here comes Gooden. One away. The ball low. Gooden is uh, hitting 100. Low again, 2 0. Ground ball to the right side, and uh, that will be uh, fielded by Cepeda. Goes to the bag himself. Two away. Here comes Mookie. Blasted to left. Hits the wall. And that'll be two at least. Here he comes. Now he's not even thinking of hesitating. Goes all the way to third base. Beats the throw. He gets a triple. And he does exactly what Lenny did yesterday. So Mookie says, Lenny who? Here's uh, Dykstra. Takes a strike. 0-1. It's another strike of the knees. 0-2. Same plays. What a pitch. Inside. Can't get him to swing. 1-2. and two, Now the count. High. 2-2. Two and two. You can see that strategy, two quick strikes, and then try to get him to chase. And uh, he does chase finally, swinging and a miss by Heap when we go to the bottom of the third. So the Mets strand the triple. Here's Jim Davenport. One hit from the Mets, two for the Giants. There's a swing and a miss by Jim. It's 0 and 1. There's a fastball low. 1 and 1 to count. Outside, 2 and 1. Hit over to center, and that's going to be a base hit over in front of uh, Wilson. The runner on at first base, it brings up Willie McCovey. Go to double play depth here. Swing and a miss by Willie, 0 and 1. And that's a ball inside, 1 and 1. Off of his fist, popped up, and that'll be Knight making the catch for the out. Uh, there's a one away. Here now is uh, Tom Haller. So a good pitch, two good pitches, I would say, in a row by Good, and finally got him to uh, pop that one off the hands. There's a ball low to Tom. Another one low and inside the Haller. Swings of this one, that's going to be fouled away. Two and one. Gooden hits him. Another curveball that he chokes. So, uh, second batter hit by Gooden. Here's Orlando Cepeda. And he'll take a ball low, 1 and 0. Oh. The ground ball back to Gooden. He has to go to first with it, and he fields it slowly. And uh, so uh, Cepeda gets the base hit. And that'll bring up Matty Alou. I think we uh, bring the corners in here. Bottom of the third, no score. Foul to the left side. It's 0-1. There's a fastball low, 1-1. One one. Ball low, 2-1. Two and, and a strike, 2-2. Two and two. Just misses low and outside. Full count. 
And it's head over to left, but that'll be foul. Full count remains. Just barely fouled that one off, did Natty. Fouls another one away, full count. Foul the way again. And that's ball four outside, so Gooden gives up yet another walk. He has walked two, struck out two. They'll bring up Jose Pagan. We're going to go to double play depth here this time, and uh, now that they've gotten the run, there's a fly ball over the right, and that will fall in front of Strawberry. That was a little nothing of a fly ball. Two runs score on that one as they were going around, and so it's 3-0 uh, now San Francisco. Gooden's not going to last long. Here's a ground ball now over to first base. Carter uh, throws to second to Santana for one, and that's all we get. Two away, and here comes the pitcher, Mary Shaw. Fouls that one away, 0-1. So three nothing is as fouled away. 0 and two. We're behind again, and there's a ball away. One and two. Swing and a miss. Down he goes. Gooden gets the strikeout, his third of the game, but uh, it's a little bit too little, too late. We go to the top of the fourth. Down three nothing. Here comes Daryl. Hit one out, Daryl. And that's a ball away. One and zero. Oh. Ball low. Two and zero oh now. The count. And there's a strike. Two and one. Swing and a miss. Two and two. That was way low and away. Strawberry makes contact, and he's going to beat this one out. Pagan fielded it, but there was nothing he could do with it. Had to eat it, and that'll bring up Carter. There was a strike. 0-1 oh, to Gary. A little high strike. Blasted to center, but uh, it's going to be playable. Matty Alou's got that for the out. One away. Here now, Ray Knight. That's a strike. 0-1. Oh, there's a little comebacker. Uh, I'm sorry, it's right in front of uh, the uh, plate. And uh, Hiller, I'm sorry, uh, Haller has it, throws to Hiller for uh, to get Strawberry out. The uh, animation there, pretty deceptive, makes it look like Strawberry was safe. He was out, according to the play-by-play. -play. We just go by what the uh, game tells us. We won't worry too much about what the animation said because there's been a lot of problems. So runner at first with two outs here, and here's Backman who takes a slider for a strike, 0-1. And, and that's a ball outside, 1-1. One and that's inside with a change of two and one. Popped up, that's gonna be out of play. Nope, it's caught, uh, caught there by the uh, third baseman. And uh, so it was, uh, I'm sorry, the catcher, it was Holler who made that catch. And so we go to the bottom of the fourth inning, still three nothing San Francisco. Here is Felipe Alou. And he'll take a strike at the knees from Gooden, no and one. Ground ball to first, and uh, that will be uh, Carter going to the bag for the out, one away. Jim Davenport now. There's a strike. Boy, I'm not sure where that pitch was. 0 and 1. Fouled away 0 and 2. So good and getting a little bit more of that confidence control back. Adds it over to right. And out of play. Low, 1 and 2. Just outside with that fastball. 2 and 2. Hard pitch to uh, take. There's a little uh, curveball, I believe, and uh, that's going to be a single at least. He's going to go for two, and he'll be able to make it. Strawberry didn't play that one very well. Double for Davenport, and that brings up Willie McCovey. So uh, Gooden not doing very well getting his lunch given to him. There's a ball and a strike. One and one the count now on Willie. Blast to deep to right, but that's foul. One and two. Popped up. And uh, it's going to be back and grabbing that for the out two away. Here's Tom Holler. The ball away to Tom, 1-0. And, oh. and that's low, 2-0. and oh. Swing and a miss, it's 2-1. and one. Swing and a miss on that one. That one looked like it disappeared, 2-2. Two and two. That curve is low, full count. Blast to the left, but that'll be foul. Blast to the center. And uh, Mookie... Times that one and makes the leaping catch, and the animation had to make it happen, so he kind of walked and then leaped for it. Kind of a weird-looking play. We go to the top of the fifth. Still 3 nothing Giants. Here comes Santana. That's a ball away. 1-0 to Rafael. Blasted to left uh, center field, and there's Natty Alou sprinting for that one, sliding, making the catch. One away. Here's Ed Hearn. And it's outside, 1-0. Oh. Mets having a hard time hitting here in uh, San Francisco. There's a strike, 1-1 one one the count. 
A little ground ball over to second base, and that one was not fielded very well by Hiller. He knocked it down through to first, and it looks like Cicada is the one who's going to be charged with the air. It brings up Dwight Gooden, and it's time to bunt, I think. They bunt back to the mound, and uh, Marichelle can only go to first, and uh, that uh, sends uh, Hearn over to uh, second uh, here from Mookie Wilson with two away. Brings the ball low to Mookie. 1-0. Outside, 2-0. Fouled away, it's 2-1. and one. Blasted to left field. Wilson with the home run, 366 feet. 3-2 to two now, Giants. And Mookie Wilson uh, doing his best Lenny Dykstra impression there, getting the uh, big home run in the clutch situation. You don't know which leadoff man you like better, and that's uh, always the eternal question. Which one do you hit first? Which one do you hit second? Three to two, and here comes Danny Heap. He can do damage as well. Takes a strike. A little low, but it was in the zone. 0 and 1. This is hit over to right. No problem for uh, Felipe. We go to the bottom of the fifth inning. Three to two. So the Mets take advantage of the air. Here comes Cepeda. There's a strike. 0 and 1. And there's a ball. 1 and 1 the count. Looking at Gooden, he's thrown 92 pitches. He won't be there for long. There's a ball inside, two and one. There's a strike, two and two. And ball to first, Carter goes to the bag himself, one away. Natty Alou now. Popped up. And it's going to be Backman making that catch for the out, two away. Here comes Jose Pagan. It's a uh, foul ball to the right, 0 and 1. And there's a uh, strike. Boy, a low strike, 0 and 2. Hit over left field, but foul. Heap can't get there in time. Still 0 and 2. Ground ball tonight, throws to first. And we go to the top of the sixth. 3 to 2, and still Giants. Here comes Daryl Strawberry. Strawberry hits one out, and we're tied. <laughs> Got to time it a little bit better than that. That was a really bad swing on that slider way behind it. That fastball, he didn't know where that one was. 0 and 2. There's a ball inside. 1 and 2 the count to Daryl. And it's a weekly foul. Strike three. And there he goes. Chasing another one outside the strike zone. One away. Here comes Carter. And it's hit over to left. And uh, that'll be easy for McCovey. Two away. Ray Knight now. Ball low, 1 0. Swing and a miss, it's 1 1. Hit to right, but foul. 1 and 2. Strike three. And down he goes. Strike on number 5 for Mary Shaw, and we go to the bottom of the sixth inning. Chuck Hiller will lead this off. Takes a strike, 0 and 1 the count. And it's outside, 1 and 1. Tight ball game. And it's fouled away. One and two. If we had the 85 good now, there wouldn't be this tight. But 86 good, not quite as good. That was in the dirt, two and two. Ground ball to first. Carter grabs that, goes to the back himself. One away. Here comes Juan Marichal. The ball outside. Marichal 0 for 1. Remember, he walked. One and, oh, 2 and 0. Oh, now the count. My apologies. And there's a strike, 2 and 1 hit over to left field. That'll be a base hit. So Gooden's still having a hard time pitching against opposing pitchers. I don't understand it, but we've seen that happen so many times in these Gooden starts. So here's Felipe Alou. We go to double play depth and there's a ball that misses inside. Another one inside, 2-0. Oh. There's a strike, 2-1. Two and one. That's a high strike, 2-2. Two and two. Swing and a miss. Down he goes. So Gooden racks up his fourth strikeout and that's all he's had. 114 pitches, and with two away, here's Davenport, who's three for three. Hits this one over to right field. On comes Strawberry, and he comes, and he makes the catch for the out. We go to the top of the seventh, still trailing three to two. Only three hits here for the Mets. Here comes Wally Backman. Remember yesterday, he hit that home run. A little fly ball over to left, but uh, that's not quite deep enough. It's McCovey who's got that for the out. One away. Santana comes up next. Foul the way, 0 and 1. Santana hitting 219, and he's been uh, struggling. Foul the way again, 0 and 2.
And it's fouled the other way, so he pulled that one. Strike three. And that's on the outside corner for strike three. That was a good call. Two away. Here comes Ed Hearn. Talk about uh, not hitting well. Hearn's 0 for 2. Reached on an air today and scored a run eventually. Takes the ball low and in. That's a ground ball deep, uh, but uh, it uh, is uh, run down by Pagan, who makes a good play on that, throws the first. We go to the bottom of the seventh inning. Here comes Willie. Willie McCovey, that is, takes the ball high. Blasts this one to center. I shouldn't say blast. Uh, Mookie Wilson had a beat on that one all the way. It was actually shallow. One away. Here's uh, Haller. Takes the ball outside. 1-0. and Swing and a miss. That's a foul ball. Excuse me. 1-1. Uh, that's a hit foul to the left side. It'll be one and two here on Holland. Hit to center, and uh, that'll be playable again for Wilson. Two away, and uh, here comes Cepeda. Ball inside, one and oh. Swing and a miss. It's one and one. And it's a ball that misses. Two and one the count. It's fouled away. Two and two. High. Full count. And that's low for ball four. So Gooden now has walked his third. That'll bring up uh, Matty Alou. This is popped up, but that's going to be foul. No way that uh, Heap can get to that one. I'm sorry. Yeah, Heap. It is him. 0-1. Oh There's a ball. 1-1 one one to count. Popped up again. 1-2. and two. Round ball to second. Backman fields it. Throws to Carter. And we go to the top of the eighth. That brings up the doctor. Here comes Dr. K, and uh, Dr. K not pitching like Dr. K very much today, more like Dr. W. Here comes George Foster into pinch hit. As I've said so many times before, that's kind of what I think of George Foster right now. 3 for 12 is a pinch hitter. Hasn't been much of one. He takes a strike outside corner. We could use his power if he could give it to us. And that's a pitch high. 1-1. One and one. Hit fouled on the right field line. Foul. 1-2. Swing and a miss. Down he goes. One away. Here comes Mookie. There's a belt high strike. That was more like chest high. 0 and 1. Well, ground ball to second. Hiller on to first. Two away. And here comes Danny Heap. Blasted but foul. First base line. There's a ball inside. 1 and 1 to Danny. Low inside, two and one. Low again, three and one the count now. And he lost him. So Marichal has walked his second, puts Heap on at first base, and they're going to make a change. That'll bring up uh, Stu Miller. Stu Miller with a five and four record, 33 innings pitched, 4.09 ERA, struck out 21, walked nine. So we'll see if we have luck against him. Here comes Strawberry. There's a strike that was off speed changeup, 0 and 1. Go to first. We're not thinking of much with Heap. There's a ball inside. One and one. And a swing and a miss by Dra- Strawberry. 0 and 2. Just makes contact and fouls that one away. 1 and 2. And misses outside. It's 2 and 2. Misses inside. Boy, nice take on that. That was close. Full count. Hit over to left. Easily playable there from McCovey, and we go to the bottom of the eighth inning. And uh, this is always the big question, who do we put in? We want to put in Sisk, and we want to put in Neiman. Well, what do we have coming up? Uh, two righties and a lefty, so I think it's Sisk. Let's see if we can make him take a couple guys out. All right, here we go. Jose Pagan will face uh, Doug Sisk, and he takes the ball outside, 1-0. Sisk was just brought up from the uh, minors, one and one. They say he was just brought up. He pitched a little bit before, and I think he was sent down and brought back up. It's one and two now. There's a fly ball, line drive rather to left field, and that'll be a uh, base hit. So that's not the way we wanted Sisk to start the, this uh, inning off. We got a double play depth. Here's Chuck Hiller, and there goes uh, the uh, runner for second, and. Uh, Pagan is safe. Good throw by Hearn, but not quite in time. And uh, Hiller with an 0-1 count. Pops this one up. 
Gonna be out of play. It'll be 0-2 on him. Inside, 1-2. and two. Inside again, and it's 2-2. Two and two. Ground ball up the middle. Uh, Santana makes the play, throws to first. One away. It brings up Willie Mays. Uh, Mays entered this game, I think, when Miller came in to uh, pitch. There is a sinker for a strike, 0-1. And, and that one just misses, 1-1. One one. Foul the way, 1-2. You like to <laughs> face this guy as a pinch hitter. Ground ball to second. Backman goes to first. We give up the run, and it's a 4-2 San Francisco lead now. Here comes Alou, two away, bottom of the eighth inning. It's a ground ball over to the left side. Knight, good play, has to hurry, throws to first and gets him. We go to the top of the ninth. So pretty good uh, inning there uh, thrown by Sisk. He does give up the one run, but um, it, it could be worse. Remember McDowell's um, outing the other day? There's a ball low to Gary, 1-0. There's a ball inside, 2-0. Swing and a miss, 2-1. Low, and it's 3-1. Hit down the right field line, but foul. Full count now on Carter. And that's low. So Carter finds a way to get on base. That'll bring up Ray Knight. Brings the ball away tonight. 1-0. Hit to right. And what a play. Great play there by Felipe Alou. Makes a diving catch. There's one away. Here comes Wally Backman. That's low. Knight is uh, looking cold again. There's another one inside and low. 2 and 0. 3 and 0 now. And that's ball four in the dirt. So Stu Miller has walked two, and that'll bring up Santana. We're not going to let him hit. Kevin Mitchell will come in, and he'll come in probably to play short. And I've told you before that um, I don't like playing him at short, but um, we have no uh, room for him in the outfield. There's a ball low. No room for him in the end. And there's a strike of the knees. 1 and 1. Swing and a miss is one and two. That's low, two and two. Ground ball should be two. They get one and that's it. Carter goes to third and it was uh, Backman who uh, was thrown out at second. Two away and that'll bring up Ed Hearn. Well, this is going to get pretty ugly if uh, we get out of this. But we're going to do it. So Ed Hearn comes out. Here comes Howard Johnson, who's hitting 176. Did have that home run. Throw to first, nothing doing. Another throw to first. Blasted on the left side. Foul for Johnson. 0 1. And that's low. 1 1. Swing and a miss. It's 1 2. Swing and a miss. And down he goes. So the Giants get the win here. 4 2. They get the revenge after being uh, shut out yesterday. And. Uh, it continues to be close. We're actually, I believe, a game behind the Giants. That puts the Mets in third place. Giants will be either six and a half, five and a half. I'm not quite sure how many behind the Dodgers. And uh, this rivalry is uh, heating up. We need the Dodgers to cool down a little bit so we can have all three teams competing. As it stands right now, it looks like the Dodgers are just going to run away with everything. So uh, Giants win this one 4-2. Exciting game. Pretty poorly hit by the Mets, but we got two runs out of it. And uh, Gooden just wasn't good enough. Um, talk to you again tomorrow. We'll have another one of these. See you then. Bye.